Welcome to Around the World Channel. Trump's impeachment lawyers rest case after three hours as Senate draws closer to vote, CBS News. The Senate reconvened at 2.34 p.m. to hear the final portion of arguments from Mr. Trump's legal team, presented by lawyer Bruce Castor. Five things to know about new CDC coronavirus guidelines, The Hill, The Hill. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC, put out a flurry of new guidance this week, with advice on topics like mask wearing and quarantining after COVID-19 exposure. NC weather, freezing rain, ice expected throughout parts of central North Carolina Saturday morning, WTVD-TV. Raleigh, North Carolina, WTVD, thousands across central North Carolina are currently without power as freezing rain moves throughout the state. Biden's stimulus gamble, massive cuts to Medicare, farm aid, Politico. At best, Republicans could use their votes to avert the impending cliff as leverage to notch GOP policy wins in negotiations later this year. How J.J. Watt might fit with the Browns, Orange and Brown Talk, Cleveland.com. Cleveland, Ohio, the Browns need to improve their pass rush and a pretty good pass rusher just hit the free agent market. The Texans and defensive lineman J.J. Melania Trump, bitter and chilly, toward her husband, CNN, Business Insider. Insider logo the word insider, close icon 2 crossed lines that form an X. It indicates a way to close an interaction, or dismiss a notification. Senator Lummis tells Elon Musk to move to Wyoming for its Bitcoin laws business insider. Insider logo the word insider, close icon 2 crossed lines that form an X. It indicates a way to close an interaction, or dismiss a notification. Generation Z workers push for $15 minimum wage as Congress, Biden debate pay for all Americans, USA Today. President Biden is pushing to raise the minimum wage to $15. Here's how that would affect the economy. Roaring Kitty to testify on GameStop alongside hedge fund managers, Fox Business. The YouTube streamer known as Roaring Kitty, who helped drive a surge of interest in GameStop Corp., will testify before a House panel on Thursday alongside top hedge fund managers. Tessica Brown will chill on Valentine's Day after Gorilla Glue Hair Saga, TMZ. Tessica Brown finally washed that Gorilla Glue right out of her hair, thanks to a surgeon, but the painful drama means her Valentine's Day's gonna be more low-key than she hoped. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want to stay tuned for upcoming news.